hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be making homemade baker buns so for today's recipe we're gonna need one cup of warm water preferably 110 degrees fahrenheit to 115 degrees fahrenheit and also one tablespoon of active dry yeast and we're gonna mix that up so here we're going to use a stand mixer. In the stand mixer, we're going to add three cups of all purpose flour, one third cup vegetable oil. So we're going to mix this up because we want our dough to be fluffy and so soft. So after you want that to be fully incorporated, We're going to add our yeast mixture, one egg, and one quarter cup of sugar. So we're going to mix that up until it's well combined. So we're going to gradually add a little bit more of flour. So I've set one cup of flour aside for gradual additions. and for flooring the surfaces. Make that up until the dough doesn't stick to the sides of the bowl. You're gonna take out your dough and knead for at least two minutes with your hands so that it fully gets incorporated and fully kneaded. So this process is very important since it will make your dough so soft, elastic, and it gives that texture. So you want that texture to come out. So don't skip this step. This is always important when you're working with doughs. <coughs> And make sure, if you want to check if the dough is ready enough, uh, you can just try to knead it without the flour. And if it doesn't stick on the surface, then it means it is ready. So when it is ready, just round it up into a very nice bowl and cut it into eight equal pieces. So after cutting into eight equal pieces, here i just float the bowl so that it won't stick and let it rest for 40 to one hour at room temperature so after one hour uh, take out your dough and you have to knead for at least two to three minutes and then after you cut a cut into eight equal balls after cutting gently round them up into very small balls And place them into a degreased and place them in a degreased baking sheet.
so after you're gonna cover that up and make it stand for 10 more minutes and for this recipe i used vegetable oil but i usually like to use one egg mixed with one teaspoon of water and just brush them on top to give it a golden glow to it very nice if you put it like that so and voila there we have our golden beautiful baker buns so you can have this fresh in freeze them and so fluffy so golden let me know if you have tried it in the comments and if you like this recipe please subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and share thank you so much guys for watching bye